this man a track down. Kill. Why do you care? It's just another bounty job, isn't it? Oh, look, I don't care. I just want to know their names. Who, Cope? One of them was a man named Randall. Been with the camp almost a year. I didn't know the other two. You want me to ask? No, I guess not. You find that son of a bitch. You radio me. Copeland out. Alright, what have we got? Gotcha. There he is! Silver helmet. Red gas tank. That's him. Oh shit! The hell? So you thought you'd ride into Copeland's camp, I shoot the place up, that about right? Kill a few folks, take some shit, and just ride out like you just... chop it in the wall. Then I'm gonna wait, did you? Myself, if you want to know the truth, give drifters a bad name. But what if you'd shot Manny? You know, who fixed my bike then? Stupid piece of shit. <laughs> Screw you! You want to cope with Tony's? You little bitch! That's what you are! You little bitch! Finally. Cope, it's done. I got him. Uh, you tell Mark down these coordinates and send your men out here. You hear me? Is he alive? Yeah, he's alive. But I won't promise you how long he's gonna stay that way. Deacon out. Yep. Boozer, you there? Just calling to check up on you. Yeah, Dee, come here. You hang in there, buddy. These people that are patched up will ride north. Another bounty. Uh, you were saying something? Uh, I hope so. God, I miss the open road. You just work on getting better. I still got some work to do on the bike, and we gotta stock up on some gear. But once you're patched up, we're out of here. Deacon out. Okay, this is it. Yeah, oh, this camp is gonna be crawling. Uh, yeah, going on foot, nice and quiet. Okay, oh, there's gotta be a nest in this shack. Oh yeah, a nest. Okay, you boys just keep right on sleeping. Don't pay no attention to me. Okay, one nest done. How many more you got? Yeah. Come on, boys and girls. Let's do this. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth <laughs> shall set you free. Black colors have been spotted in the skies. You might escape. Heard them. Thought you were losing your mind. But you're not. right. We thought Nero died out here like the rest of them, caving under their own stupidity. But no, like I said, they've been lying and wait all this time so they can crawl up out of their holes and reclaim this world. But it ain't happening. Not on my watch. And don't go running towards them thinking they're gonna save your ass. Any man wearing a uniform worth a damn died more than two years ago. These men, they'll shoot you on sight. 
This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Jesus. Cope, they're not trying to reclaim shit. You don't have a damn clue what you're talking about. Except, yeah, yeah, they will shoot you on sight. Lucky guy. you want to call home, yeah? God damn it, what you all shit yourself at once? Jesus Christ. Oh, goddamn freaks. What the hell are you doing in here? Huh? Oh, this place is a death trap. Get kind of cold out of here. That I know you Okay. the last of them. Finally. Boozer, it's done. Boozer, it's done. I cleared those nests. Should be less freaks on the mountain from now on. Hey, Deke. How'd it go? Were there, were there a lot of them? Yeah, but I wanted to clear them while it was still light out. You know how the sunlight bothers them. Yeah, that's, that's probably the way to do it. Anyway, thanks for, thanks for doing that thing. Get some shut-eye, Boozer. Deacon out. <laughs>
fuel can. On. I never did finish burning out this nesting zone.
You're gonna be okay. Hey, hey, it's not safe out here in the shit. I know where there's a camp that... I'll go, I'll go. Where? Show me, show me! Peaceful Lake. Mark Copeland. It's safe there. Thank you so much for stopping. I was so dead. I was never getting out of there. Thank you. Tell him it was Deacon. Deacon St. John. Okay, keep running. Stay out of sight.
Where's Tucker? Alki. Over at the dig site. Well, which one, goddammit? The north one. Back there. If anybody touches this bike, or anything on it, I break your fingers. Whatever, man. Jesus. I keep telling you, everywhere you look, it's all one giant lava field. 25 feet solid rock. It'll take jackhammers to... I don't need a lecture, goddammit. I get it. No, you don't. But these people are hungry, even if they had all their strength. It'll take them months to finish this job with picks and shovels. I don't give a shit! We're all hungry, Al. But this job's gotta get done whether it takes all goddamn year. It's not like we got somewhere else to be now, do we? Wait. Not finished. We'll make it quick, will ya, Al? I got things to do. Rippers. This morning, one of my men spotted a large group of them coming over the pass. And no one stopped them? How the f... Tucker, you know we're already spread thin. Are, are they headed north? Al! Are they headed towards us? Yes or no? I... I don't know. Maybe he knows. <laughs> what the fuck are you up to now, huh? What's this about, huh? Damn it, Alki. It's not his job to know. It's your goddamn job to know. I can't be at two places at one time. You're the one me here, running your dig? You want me out there in the shit? Chasing the rippers. Go check the store, see how much ammo we got left. I'll tell Wheeler to watch the dig. What are you looking at? Oh, I don't know, I'm just waiting for you to smarten the fuck up. Don't! Did you track down Leon? Good thing someone around here knows how to make things happen. Ride with me. How long's it been since you found someone, brought him in? The kind of people left out in the shit aren't the kind of people you want me bringing in. We lost two more to the fever. It's not my problem. You want our food? I'm making it your problem. I told you we'll do runs for you, but we're not joining your goddamn camp. Remind me again, my old woman's memory. Why is that? Because it's a waste of time, Tuck. <laughs> well, aren't you the optimist? Where's Boozer? He said he was gonna head over to Copeland's camp, see about trading for some fish. You're not in bed with Cope now, are you? His camp near yours? It's not closer or further. Look, I'm not Boozer's old lady. He goes I where he wants. Kill myself. Jesus, knows, dude. you keep the shit burning all day and night. Got a lot of freak corpses piling up out here. With men like you doing your jobs, damn right we keep it burning. Try using more gasoline. It burns faster, less fumes. Like we got so much to spare? When it's all gone, what are you gonna put in that bike of yours, spit and sweat? Now what the hell is going on here? The count's off. Storage is missing food and some ammo. Jesus, who was on watch last night? Wheeler. Tonight, double the watch. This shit's starting to piss me off. You got it. Trouble in paradise? It's like I was saying. Camp's like a prison. Bunch of goddamn lazy liars, thieves, rapists, and murderers. You know why that is? No idea. Cause that's who we are. The freak show. Only folks survived were those mean enough, nasty enough to out-freak the freaks. The rest are here. Hoping I feed them, protect them, keep them nice and cozy and warm, so they can sit on their asses and watch the world end. You! Get your ass back to work! Don't make me go get Cyrus! 
lazy sons of bitches can screw around all they like on their time. Daytime is my time. Running this camp is no different than running a prison. I can't remember what you said. You were, you were what? You were a warden or something? <laughs> Nothing so high and mighty. I was matron of the women's ward. You look like the sort who might have spent some time in the pen, back in the day. You ever do time? I had my share of trouble, but I never landed in K-State. I got a job for you. Larson was on a run yesterday. Passed through Marion Forks, said he saw someone. Young woman looked like, but he only caught a glance. He stopped to look around, but he never found her. Is he sure? Larson's been doing this long as you. He knows a person from a freak. But you got a knack for this. You head over there and find her before the freaks do. I'll see what I can do. But look, Tuck, I want the rest of my credits for Leon. You bring me warm bodies, I'll give you all the credits you can spend. I gotta go find Wheeler. Someone's looking at a night in the shack. Uh, hey! What's up? Stuff's getting the scarce. Needs a tune up. See you. Hey, uh, hey, uh, I haven't seen Boozer around much lately. Yeah, he's around. I guess he's just been doing more work for Copeland lately. <laughs> you tell him I said get off his ass and do some work for me. Yeah, I'll let him know. Whatever. Later, man. So Come am on. I on your trust list or no? Alcott. What do you want, Drifter? What's your problem? Hmm? One of my men uh, escaped to Ripper Camp over by Iron Butte. Got tortured. Like they always do. But this time they kept asking me if you knew about it. Two bikers, two men, asking me if you'd ever seen them or heard of them. A lot of bikes around here. What's it, what's it got to do with me? The Ripper called them mongrels. How many drifters still flying colors around here? As if that shit matters. You ask me, you got a price on your head. How's it feel to be on the other side? Yeah, why don't you just show me what you got because I don't have time for your bullshit. Whatever you say, Deke.
powerful. Good shot. You'll like this one. Okay, sure. Now I just gotta figure out who I'm gonna give this to. Can't head north until I get this bike fixed up. Copeland it is.